from Ninja Teacher here. Today it is the weekend and we all have the day off, so myself and a group of friends are going to take a road trip out of the city and go uh, explore what's outside of Saigon. Okay, so Dom, want to tell us what we're doing today and where we're going? Yeah, so today we're going to Tui Chao uh, Eco Tourism Park. Uh, it's about an hour north drive from Saigon Central. So we're all gonna pack up with some food and drinks and take ourselves up there. There's a beautiful stream there. Uh, it's a great place for uh, locals as well to go and have barbecues and uh, family fun activities. Fun. walking around and we saw this fenced in area with some statues of crocodiles which were cool but we were like oh that's kind of strange we stared at them for a while and they were definitely statues and then as we walked back we realized that they were moving and actually there are like 25 real giant crocodiles right here right next to the kids pool so we'll show you some footage of that but they're pretty scary So Dom, why don't you tell us how you found out about this place in the first in the first place? Absolutely. This place right here, below me. Okay. I uh, thought to myself, what if I looked at a map and looked all over that map? And I, so I did. And then boom! I said boom! Kaboom! I saw it with my eyes and my teeth. And so I drove here on my bike. Whoa! <laughs> just finished up for the day. Uh, this was excellent. We had so much fun swimming and having a picnic and, and just hanging out. So where we've come is an eco park in Binyung, which is right outside of Saigon. So it took us a little over an hour, around an hour to get out here. Uh, entry is 100k, so that's around five US dollars. And we spent the whole day here. There are vendors that rent out uh, mats that you can sit on, there is food you can buy and drinks, uh, a lot of people just drinking beers or, or liquor and, and hanging out with their whole families here. Uh, we met a lot of really great Vietnamese families and, and had a lot of fun today, so we're going to head back for the evening, but this is definitely something I recommend checking out. Uh, in the description, we'll link the Google Maps location for anyone that's interested in coming out here. But as Dom explained, he was just looking on a map and wanted to go for a drive, and that's how he found it. So uh, we came out today and, and had a great time. Okay, so it's Sunday morning now. I have actually been a little sick for the past week or so and haven't really been feeling that great, but nevertheless, we're gonna go out. Uh, one of my friends who I actually did the TESOL course with back in 2017 is getting ready to finish up her time in Vietnam. So we're going out to do a brunch at East West Brewery and then we're going to a Saigon Heat basketball game. So we'll film along the day and, and you can kind of get a look at what you might do here with the friends that you may meet on your course if you come out and get started. So let's go. Okay, Leah, so why don't you tell us how long you've been here in Vietnam? So I've been here in Vietnam for about a year and a half. Um, it's been absolutely amazing the entire time. Um, wonderful friends, 
great, great culture, good food. <laughs> so Leah and Dima and I, with my group of friends here, most of us met on the TESOL course here in Saigon back in 2017, like I mentioned earlier. And Leah's getting ready to wrap up her time here, but there's still some of us who are staying. So it's definitely one of the best parts for all of us, I think, is the community that we've built here. Guys, the